Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel and thank you for watching. So I have a special guest with me today, my husband. And we are going to be sharing with you guys the supplements we take to help boost our immune system and overall health. So the first one we're going to talk about is the CoQ10 and this basically just helps overall with like vitamin C, vitamin E. So it doesn't necessarily help with those vitamins, right? It helps with the production, um, cardiovascular health, right? You guys hear about the coronavirus. A lot of the people with those underlying health conditions, um, they, they tend to have heart conditions, right? Hypertension, high blood pressure, um, and then plus other immune uh, deficiencies. This is definitely good to take again because of the coronavirus, coronavirus going around, people with underlying health conditions, so highly suggest taking this. So next up is the wellness formula and this is really good to take if you're starting to kind of feel any sort of tickle in your throat. You want to take this right away to kind of like kick it in the butt right away. Yeah, so this is more preventative, right? We don't take this on a day-to-day -day basis. If you look just, I mean, I'm not sure if you can see the back of this here, but there's just so many th herbs, vitamins, and nutrients in this that, I mean, it'll, it'll knock everything out of you. And another tip, it also helps with hangovers. So you want to take this before you go to bed if you're not too drunk with a tall glass of water. So next up is the wild Alaskan fish oil. And we try and take this every day as well. I mean, fish oil is just good. Yeah, all your omega-3, 6, and 9s, right? Cardiovascular health, antioxidants, anti-inflammatory. You know, it really touches upon... The you know, the big items that you really want to you know, make sure you're, you're doing well with on a day-to-day -day basis. Cardiovascular health, your brain health, your joint health, and then eye health, right? Um, so again, help with all those. So next up we have zinc, and zinc is pretty much in every cell of your body. Helps with joint tissues, etc. And um, helps boost your immune system as well. It's, it's needed, right? I mean, you hear a lot of people with the coronavirus, zinc's flying off the shelf. Um, it helps your immune system. Um, and, and I'm sure there's other benefits we're not aware of, but for whatever reason, it seems to be helping um, the people with that that get the coronavirus. And we take this every day, right? I would say. Yeah, we take it every day. Yeah. So probiotics, pretty much everyone knows how good they are for you. You could take it before a meal or after a meal, really, right? So it doesn't really matter. I don't think there's a right or wrong way. It's just to continuously improve your gut health, right? Because that it really is a big driver into your immune system. Um, this one here we have has 90 billion guaranteed um, strains, right? Um, there's 15 different probiotic strains, which is re really important. Uh, not many people know that there's different strains for your probiotic. And yeah, just to improve your gut health will drastically improve your overall wellness. So next up we have a multivitamin. Obviously you want to take a multivitamin every day. Um, this one we got, what at Fountain? Yeah, so we have a local store by us uh, called Fountain. Uh, they're, they're big into alkaline, uh, whether it's water and other products and supplements. Um, so they, tell, they say here that this one's actually food derived. Um, it's a sustainable release of the multivitamin, right? Um, and it just hits on all the key vitamins and nutrients that you need on a day-to-day -day basis. Uh, you know, making sure obviously all the serving sizes are correct and they did a really good job with this. Next up is vitamin C. Obviously because of the coronavirus going around, you really want to stock up on this. Even like when we feel like we're getting sick, we take like, this is a thousand milligrams. So we take like what, six in a day? Or yeah, so we take at least six in a day as soon as you start to feel something. I sometimes do a little more than her. I'll go up to 10, you know, two, two times a day. I'll do five, pill, uh, five pills um, to get 10,000. And it definitely goes a long way. People think you can overdose on vitamin C. Whatever you don't use, your body releases in your urine. Yeah, so highly suggest taking this. Okay. So next up is spirulina and chlor chlor chlorella. chlorella. Okay. Yeah. And that's a superfood. He knows more about it than I do. <laughs> yeah. Um, so, I mean, most people know about this already, right? They say it's, it has a ton of ant antioxidants, um, anti-inflammatory, and it really does boost your immune system. And it helps detox. Right, so if there's anything in your body weighing your immune system down, this does a good job of kind of flushing that stuff out. Do you take this every day? Yeah, I take it every day. Okay, so next up we have the Colloidal Silver Nasal Spray. I've never used this, but yeah, so it's on open. We neither of us use this. Um, I went to Vitamin Shop and picked this up because Colloidal Silver is really good at attacking the viruses in your body, and being that the coronavirus actually gets into your lungs, um, the nose spray will get right in there. Uh, to hopefully 
combat the virus. So next up we have essential oils. This is oregano and this is clove and these help Oh my god, significantly, but yeah. they taste disgusting. They they do. Yes. Um you can even you can rub it on your chest, put it on your feet. We have a diffuser that you can put it in and it really helps with any sort of sickness, really. Yeah, <laughs> so um if you put a drop in water and, and down it, um if if you're having a sore throat or anything going on there, make sure you, you, you have food grade, right? That's important. But if you are gonna put on your skin, uh these two are pretty potent, so you wanna have a carrier oil such as almond oil, coconut oil. Now we tend to use the coconut oil. Um, you know, you put a couple drops in your hand, put some coconut oil, um, and then you actually rub it on the bottom of your feet because is they they absorb the oils really well. And yeah, just it, it helps so much. We notice a difference within like a day or so. Definitely. Yeah. I mean, we're a big believer in like all natural remedies, essential oils, yeah. and obviously all all of these vitamins, vitamins and vitamins supplements. And supplements. Yeah. All right, so hopefully this video helped you guys. We just wanted to share with you some things that we take that helps us and hopefully can help you too. Yeah, stay safe, um, stay healthy. And if there's anybody that's old or susceptible to this, make sure you stay away from them. All right. All right, guys, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that little notification bell so you never miss a post. And I will see you in my next video.